All right, people, welcome back. More vitamin Y. Apologize if this video is late. I've just been super busy with everything. Like videos, league, it's just, oh my god. I hate, I hate this. <laughs> I hate being so busy that time just slides by and then I gotta render and upload all the videos and that takes time too. It's just like, god damn it. Anyway, today Thursday it means that we're using Gretel Yubel. Hopefully everything goes okay. At least goes decently. This hand is not the greatest. You know. That slime debris dragon, neither one of these two can really do much for me right now. You know, I don't control two great monsters. The great card that I got. Okay, but I didn't do anything. Alright, I got an alligator. That's not terrible. It's not terrible at all. I'm just kind of questioning whether I should take it fast or take it slow, you know? I think I'm going to take it slow. I think I'm just going to go ahead and set my monster in. in. I guess go ahead and set the split. It's still in reverse, too? Memorverse is kind of meh, to say the least. Memorverse works really well with, uh, with Cobra. Because Alligator, I usually get it mixed up. Because I'm like, oh, it's just a straight period. Like, no, it's either by destroyed by battle or by spell card. Alligator's good because with, you know, the greater impact. Mm, I'm about to say, if that's all you're going to do, you're not going to be able to get over me. <laughs> so, that's unfortunate to say the least. I just call by targeting one face of monster you control. Equip it to that monster, get a and tie it. Do you mean it's this equipped monster? If this card is equipped to a monster by its own effect, you can send this card to the graveyard, destroy the equipped monster, if you just have summoning two gradles. Very dark with different names. Hmm. Sorry, hand. Okay, yeah, you can target two gradle cards you control, destroy them. If you do, special summon this card. Okay. You can only get to this card once this card is summoned, you can target it. One Gradle monster, a Gradle is for summoning. Okay. Well, Gradle Eagle is when it's destroying monster effects, and this does miss timing because it's if. So if I actually summon Gradle Eagle and then destroy them both, summon Slime, Eagle will go off and take his monster and then, you know, uh, go ahead and use Slime effect to summon. So. But I'm not sure if I want to do that or not. I mean, like I said, going going into uh, Glaredal Dragons is just always good. So I'm going to target cards your opponent because up to number one water monsters you synchro summon. So of course it would be two, so I get to pop two cards. Just not bad. Not bad. I think I might go this method and hold on to the eagle just in case shit hits the fan. So I'm going to activate equip. Okay. I don't think he's gonna have a problem with that. And I'll get to I'll just go ahead and destroy these two summon slimes. Slimes go ahead and summon back alligator and go into Gradle Dragon. Go to Dragon, pop you two back row and run over your magician. Alright, I guess then it's fine. So I'm gonna go ahead and destroy you, because that's that it's a Gradle card. It's also a Gradle card. Special summon. Get my effect. And summon this way, and go ahead and summon a great all monster in the best position. A alligator, I would not get alligator's effect because it was destroyed by a monster effect, not by a spell or by battle. Go ahead and sink. Go ahead and go into great old dragon. Effect, destroy these two. Alright, in response to attack of one monster, you control the two. Send this to the target to the graveyard. I'll just send to, send to the graveyard. Alright, well, I was still summoned, so. You summon from the deck? I'm supposed to summon one dark spell. Yeah, from the deck. Or graveyard. It's a lot of cards that this deck runs when you can just, you know, use monsters. Use my monsters. That's also the show. I'm still sure. Let me see, I'm still synchro summon, so that's still destroyed, despite you tributing me essentially. Sending me to a graveyard to special summon a dark spell cast monster from your rear deck. I was still synchro summon properly. And I wasn't destroyed by battle by a card effect. I 
still synchro summon. So go ahead and destroy that for me. And I have a normal summon this turn. I guess I'll go ahead and summon Eagle Crash into his Endymion and take it. Thank you. I'll go ahead and normal summon. Go ahead and crash. I'll take 12. Set. Put my system spell in chop card zone and give me your Endymion. I'll go ahead and take him. You don't need him. Seven. That's one way to go ahead and handle the situation. Go ahead and set the slimmer at verse and end my turn. Oh, that griddles are just so good. They are so good. <laughs> it's not stealing your monsters. Your synchro monster is good. Their spells are good. Their traps are good. Like I don't think they have. A single bad card. I think all their cards are good. Like that's that's some craziness. When all every single one of your cards is good, yeah. So you're just gonna scoop it up. I was gonna go ahead and go into clearing with uh, the Bruce Dragon. The Bruce Dragon, go ahead and summon back Alligator, and then bam, clearing, clearing with Endymion. That should be game. Yeah, that would, that would be game. I've heard, I didn't. What like points do you have left? You just like just do the math. I don't feel like it. <laughs> Go ahead and get another duel in. There's a lot of synchro plays on here on uh, Vimin 1. New Bar Trains is just a normal deck. Then Labrador Reel is a synchro deck. Then Shadali Bell is a fusion deck. Well, I guess it could do everything, but it's closer, more related to a fusion deck. Uh, I didn't open up terrible. It's up pretty well. Go ahead and just mirror what you did. We'll just go ahead and take it slow. You come after me. So destroy that battle by trap. I think Cobra might be my favorite just because it works really well with Limit Verse, with Call, with Magical Magic Planter. I think that's pretty cool. I can just go ahead and you know revive one of my Gradle monsters. Can I only use the effect once per turn? No. No. Oh, there's nothing about that. So. I said, I need you to go on the offensive. This is a very defensive deck. This is a very slow-paced deck, so I need you to come after me. Okay. This is going off during the damage step, so there's no dodging out of the way. Give me a monster. There's no oh, farm girl effect. Mm -mm. This is uh, this is during the damage step. So give me your farm girl. No, no, no. This is during damage step. Back to hand. You can't use her effect during the damage step. Back to hand. I'm taking your monster. Thank you. Is that slippers? No, it isn't. No, it isn't. It is resolving after attack declaration. Can't chain them. Huh? Yeah, that's slippers. He went, farm girl, attack into my uh, Cobra. Cobra, during the damage step, I'm going to go ahead. I'm destroyed, I'm gonna resolve my effect, take your monster, and he's like, oh, chain effect, like, how do you chain the effect? I'm resolving my effect, I take your monster. There is no in-between chain for farm girl to go off. Like, yeah, you might as well just go ahead and quit. Like, I'm literally going off at the same time during, like, fucking Mystic Tomato or stuff like that. Or Raikou, like, you can't <laughs> do anything unless it's something to negate me or a counter trap. Either something to affect attack, but something to negate me, or a counter trap, there's really nothing you can do. There's no time for a farm girl to go ahead and hop out of the way. 
said, hey, people don't know. It's okay. I said, that's why, that's why we do on DN, to inform people. If they don't want to be straight ignorant, say, choose fucking hit rock scissors. That was a pretty good hand, too. I probably could have had a lot of fun with that hand. Too bad he had to be a scrub and quit, so. I don't even know what his set monsters are. Like, what are you doing setting? Mmm. Well, I opened up pretty well, but I don't, I don't like giving away my deck, you know? Because the search effect happens during the end phase, but as soon as I activate the Great Old Impact, then bam, I'm revealed, you know? Yeah, I guess I'll go ahead and take it slow. Yeah, I'll take it slow. Set the alligator, and if he doesn't want to come after it, then I could just griddle impact it. Oh god, here we go. Here we go. You know what? I could do this duel, but I really don't feel like it. No, I'm not. I'm not going to do... The only reason I'm not going to do this duel is because I want to spend more time dueling and not watching him play with himself. I said, I respect Ritual Beast. They're a good deck, but god, they take a marathon-ass turn. And I'm just not in the mood to be sitting here watching him duel. You know, I, I, I'm assuming you guys came here to see me play Yu-Gi-Oh, not him, so. Because that turn is going to take a cool minute with the loopage and the loopage and the loopage and the loopage. Like, I'm not, I probably lose that duel anyway. I'm too slow to be keeping up with Ritual Beast destroying me with Steve, so. Damn, I just got all the fucking Ritual Beasts. I'll just go ahead and take it slow. Damn, I didn't get any any back row. Any, not, the majority of this deck is traps. I didn't get none. Even one would have been nice. It's this monster hand. Okay. Hopefully I'll be in, I'll be able to chill enough to take a couple monsters and stay into this duel. Set, set, set. Well, I guess I can come after it with, with Armageddon Knight. Or I might just be dueling against Infinity Dot Deck. And if that's the case, then no thank you. Infinity can negate my Gradles. Because, once again, things that negate can definitely go ahead and negate me during the damage step. Okay, when he drops Infinity on me, this will not be a fun duel. Not at all. I am way too slow to be keeping up with the pace of infinity. Definitely. Right. You got three back row, so. Okay. So I'll go ahead and I'll gladly oblige and ask you if it's good. At least I didn't draw it to Nightmare. I limit rush too. It's not bad. I really don't want to kill you, but I'm going to have to kill you. Yeah. The duel won't advance unless I kill you. Okay. Go ahead. Like I said, I used to respect Cyber Dragons. I used to be like, you know what, Cyber Dragons, got your structure deck, not bad, you're pretty cool. And then, it's like Infinity Dot Deck. I do not know why you didn't MST during the end phase. That was kind of dumb. That was really kind of dumb. And then you already know. That it used to be a, a, a decently respected structure deck. Now it's literally just why, like I said, I drove right there. Why would anybody play Cyber Dragons if you're not going to go into Infinity? Or this guy just doesn't want to go into Infinity. I guess. Go ahead, go ahead and go into Infinity. I don't care.
What sort of unique attack can be sure to attack on Cyber Dragon Monster in your graveyard? Okay, well, they don't have one, so. No effect on that. He is gonna get his frickin' fusion, though. This card in your possession. Possession, possession. Possession, possession, possession. I'm trying to think. Possession means that he owns it, right? This card in your possession. What does it mean? Yeah, it's his card. Yeah, it's his card. So, even it's still in his possession, even though I control it. So, he's still going to get his fusion monster unless I can do something to stop this from going off when Terra goes off. Which I don't think I can. So, I'd be bad. Even if I use Great Old Eagle, it would be prior, player turn priority. So, during the end phase, I would go off, he would go off. Chain resolves backwards, so he would summon his fusion monster and then Great Old Eagle would take it. Hmm. Hmm. It's not a terrible idea. That is not a terrible idea. I might just go ahead and do that. Because it's player turn priority. Yeah. No, I'm fuck it. I'm gonna go ahead and do that. I'm gonna get a night attack. No attack. Equal attack. Okay. It's optional. Are you also optional or are you mandatory? You can. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and end. Uh, I'm going to go ahead. Well, I don't have anything to target. So actually, Eagle can't even go off because I don't even have a target to select at the current moment. So, uh... Well, his effect is optional, so if he's not going to say anything, then... Yeah, if you're not going to say anything, like, oh, effect, then I'm not going to do anything about it, you know? And you know, I could take out Infinity anyway. I really could. I can literally just summon one of my Gradles, come after your infinity. Of course you're going to go ahead and negate me, or I'll take you, and then terrible wipe you during the end phase, so. Because right now, there's not much that, uh... Ooh. It's a junior junior, but that fusion was correct. Yep. So. Twin. Well, Twin doesn't do anything against me, because I can't be destroyed a battle, so. That literally did nothing. Great old impact. Man, I wish I still had my alligator. Like I said, if I want to, I could take the damage. I can just go ahead and summon, crash, take, tap, tap, and gain. That might be best. Just go ahead and wrap this duel up. And wrap this video up, actually. I really don't have time. I still gotta record other videos. I gotta get this rendered up low. This video is supposed to go up at 12. It is now 1. So, that's, that's awesome. <laughs> That's just terrible, actually. I'm fucking the worst. I'll go ahead and pick the 18. Act. Go ahead and equip. Act. 28. Act. 28 again. There we go. Alright, people. I'm gonna go ahead and call it episode. So. Uh, like I said, I gotta get this edited, rendered, upload, for the, you'll probably get this at maybe two, but then I also gotta do daily duels, I'm just super far behind. Lee, cause it's got me freaking busy as hell. Stanzi hasn't been on, and it's just, it's just, it's just terrible right now. Anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed, so thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and, uh, we'll see you guys tomorrow with, uh, Cosmic Kilo. Another Synchro deck. Three out of the five decks I'm driving are Synchro decks. Hmm. Anyway, thanks for watching.